Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. You're watching Makeover Tales and I'm Hindu. Today I'm going to tell you about how I take care of my hair and how I oil my hair. So yeah, uh, let's get started. So now I'm going to tell you about the oil I use for my hair. The first, the base oil is this. Uh, this oil I got it from um, Nail Grease uh, when I was in a tour a couple of months ago. Uh, they, gave, they just gave me the spices and I added some coconut, organic coconut oil into it. It's got uh, fenugreek seeds, uh, rose petals, avarampu uh, and uh, vetiver and all other spices you need for the hair growth and the, and the texture of the hair. So I, I use this as a base oil and you can also use coconut oil if you want and whatever oil of your preferences. And second one is the olive oil. Olive oil improves your hair texture as well as uh, it uh, promotes the hair growth. So I use this. And third one is the citadora oil. Citadora oil is a kind of eucalyptus oil. I got it from Del Grace as well. So it's got a. Uh, it improves your hair texture. Like I've been using this for a month now, and it also improves my texture. So I use this. And, and castor oil, uh, I've told a lot about castor oil in my previous video, you can also check it, check them out and I use this for scalp. So these are the oils I use. Now I'm going to pour all of the oil in the bowl here. So the, the base oil or the coconut oil. You can, you can, uh, you can pour it as for your, your preferences, your, as for the length of your hair. And uh, now it's the olive oil. I use the base oil more and the other oil uh, a little bit, just a little bit, like uh, a three spoons or so. Now I'm going to pour the citadora oil. And a little bit of castor oil. Anyways, we are going to use it again for So yeah, just a little bit. So I've just taken this much guys a little bit I think you can see it so now I'm going to apply it uh, apply the oil and uh, show it to you guys I've already detangled my hair like, so now I'm going to take it into sections so now I'm taking the first section the bottom most section of my hair and the rest of the hair, I'm going to tie it into a knot and then So these are the first bottom section of my hair So I'll detangle it a bit Both of them So now I'm going to take a little bit of the oil And I'm just Running through it, my through the hair, with my fingers. Do it twice or or thrice. Yeah, and then comb comb it once again so that it spreads evenly to, to the ends. So I'm going to do the same thing to the other end. So the first part is done. We'll take the next session. Divide the part into two. I'm going to do the same with the other section. I'm going to do the same to all other sections.
uh, to my entire hair. Now I'm going to tell you like how to apply oil to the scalp. So first, I'm going to take the castor oil, uh, some castor oil because since it it gives you, it has properties of uh, improving the hair growth and and stuff. So I'm going to use it in my scalp. So yeah. It, it also got antifungal and antibacterial properties so it will prevent you from the dandruff and stuff basically it improves the hair growth I'm taking some more and apply it all over the scalp especially in the front we girls tend to put a lot of ponytail and you know the elastic very tight so naturally the hair in the front gets we get bald it so yeah keep doing it So now keep massaging with the scalp, your scalp, sorry, and you can also back comb it if you want. Like I always do back comb it because it will increase the, you know, blood circulation of your in your scalp, which leads, to, which awakens the skin in the hair. So yeah, I'm I'm going to back comb it for a while. So this is how I oil my hair. Air care is very essential because we girls tend to blow dry it, straighten it, curl it, everything is fine when you're pretty but uh, at the end of the day how you take care of your hair is very important. Oil it twice a week and add some natural remedy to your hair whenever it's possible and uh, also braid it up before you go to bed because if you don't then your hair is more prone to breakage and damage. So these small changes will make a huge difference to your hair quality as well as the breadth of the hair. So yeah, uh, I hope you find this video useful. If you did, give it a thumbs up, like, share and subscribe and also press the bell icon to be notified. So until next time, bye.